Hey guys, coming to you to uh, let you know and go and enjoy and explore this wonderful journey that I'm about to go on. Are you ready? Are you ready for this? 12 day water fast. Yeah, so maybe a little too dramatic, maybe a little bit too much showmanship, but I uh, just wanted to kind of give you guys a brief overview of what I plan on doing. Um, a little bit of why, and then also <laughs> some before shots of the El Gato. So you can track my progress along with me. Anyway, uh, what we're going to do is a uh, 12-day water fast. Of course, any, anybody that's ever followed any of my weight loss journeys in the past, I've, I've big believer in fasting. I've done intermittent fasting on and off for you know three years. Had really good benefits with it You know when I stick to it. Sometimes it gets hard, like around the holidays or if you're traveling, you know, it's hard to stick to it because you got to eat when you can. Uh, COVID really made it hard just because of um, how, like, I guess limited the schedules were. And so it made it harder to plan. It seemed harder. Maybe it was just a stress thing. I don't know. But anyway, regardless. However, I, I went to the doctor recently and have, I do have some liver um, issues. I had one of my liver enzymes was elevated. And so that's indicative, I guess, of, of having some minor liver damage, not major, you know, nothing major. They're basically just said, you know, stay away from alcoholic beverages, try to limit your fatty foods. You should be fine. Right. But, but I'd rather not just do that. I want to, you know, go a little overboard and try to heal it completely. And I watched a, um, a documentary called the science of fasting. And then also, um, fasting the amazon's got one too about fasting a couple documentaries that really tout the healing aspects of fasting and not just the weight loss um and bodybuilding and all that kind of stuff which it's good for also but especially the intermittent fasting because you're you're trying to capitalize on the on the hormone effects of the fasting without actually depriving your body you know completely of calories so that you can build muscle and become more lean and all of those things which i mean i'm not not huge like i still got a couple of abs maybe a little bit but yeah so there's your before i guess yeah, a little a little bit chunky but not like fat by any means you can really tell it on the face you can always tell on someone's face but anyway so i'm gonna do 12 days i was gonna do either seven 10 or 12 and you know, I prayed about it, meditated on it, and you know, 12 is the number that just kept sticking in my head, and, and it's, trust me, the one I least want to do, because that's <laughs> that's the longest one, right? But anyway, we're gonna try it out. We're gonna see how it goes. Uh, hopefully, you know, if anyone does watch this, you can kind of help keep me honest and and help motivate me, give me some words of encouragement to keep me going, because I'm sure there are gonna be times where I'm gonna want to quit so bad. Um, and I'm going to kind of count on friends and family and okay, not so much family, but friends and Facebook friends and YouTube followers and all that kind of stuff to sort of keep me going and hope for the best, hope for good health benefits. Um, I do have the readout of my liver enzymes from before, you know, the thing that sparked this whole journey. So once I'm done with the 12 day fast, I'm going to go back and get them read again. And I'll let you guys know if, if it healed the liver or not. As far as I know, it's the only issues that I really have is just liver. So it's the only provable issues. I'm sure I got some, you know, up here. <laughs> anyway, um, yeah, so so that's why we're doing it. And it's going to be really difficult. I'm having my, my uh, final food party tonight, so to speak. Party of one because it's just me here. But I am going to do uh, stuffed crust pizza. You got to go out right. You gotta go out with a bang and uh, and then a big old brownie, you know, to spike that blood sugar way up there before I crash it way down. So anyway, anybody who's interested in following and seeing what this journey does to me, my health and my body, um, just hit a like button, hit subscribe and hit the notification bell. That way you can not miss out on a single update. All right, thanks so much guys. Peace out.